Hello! Hi, how are you? Welcome back to Disney Sorcerer Arena. I know it's been a little while since I've done a video and you're like, the lighting in your face is a little weird. Well, got a light over here and then the natural light coming out of my back one. No, I'm sorry. That's not good enough. Um, it happens. You know how it goes. So I wanted to talk to you about, um, for those of you who are seeing the data, um, Hercules came out yesterday. And here um, we have the Hercules event. I'm just going to move my my camera over here. Get the Hercules event, and uh, can't go too far in it because the mother mother Gosnell, and then the coastal conflict, which is always good when it comes back. Um, but I wanted to tell I wanted to talk to you about my thoughts on the game and. Uh, kind of let's brainstorm about what may might be coming next as far as new teams because um real quick we'll just jump into what's going on here um mythical wise and as we as we all know that hercules just came in yesterday and i'm not a whale i mean i'm a, I'm a dolphin i do spend a little bit of money on this game every now and then but it's not like I'm one of these guys that has to have tier 8, 8 star, whatever, um, so I don't have, um, any of the Hercules characters aside from Hermes, who they just basically gave you, um, 25 fragments off to, to unlock, um, for free, I don't, but I don't have Phil, I don't have Pain and Panic, I don't have Pegasus, and I don't have Mag, and I don't have Hercules, obviously, um, so you know, there, there's that. So obviously we have the Hercules team it is probably the first official mythical team because as you can see the rest of the characters are Merlin, Madame M, um, Olaf, who's on the who's part of the Frozen team, but he's not on his he's on the mythical team. Um, Manticore, who's on the Onward team, and obviously Ian and Barley aren't aren't here. Hades, who's been in the game since launch, he is a Hercules character, but like I said, he's a villain, and he is, you know, that's the reason why they bring out, uh, brought out Pain and Panic, is to make him a lot more effective, because if you try to gear Hades, um, obviously there's a reason I don't have him at gear 7, but then again, I don't have Metal Mim or in Merlin at gear 7 either, um, and that's because Hades is, I've heard, takes a lot of resources to um, level and gear up and so you know panic and pain I think they put panic and pain in here to make that that um, investment in Hades a little bit more viable um, easier to deal with and up until about a month ago or, or two months ago or something we didn't have that we didn't even have a, have a leader for the mythicals now we do in, in Miguel Miguel has Miguel is the leader for the mythics um, and interestingly enough none of the Hercules team has leadership now Zeus may but as of right now he doesn't as of right now you can't even tell what any of his abilities do but whatever moving on um at the oceanics um Ursula wasn't, Ursula's obviously the raid boss, and I obviously don't have enough tokens to open her. Maui's in the game, I'm probably going to be able to open Maui next time his events comes back. I'm having Moana. I always do the Stitch Tower when it's when it's working, and as you can see, I almost have Gantu, Gantu is not, Gantu is 7 stars, and Bubbles is almost 8 stars, so that'll help you with the Stitch event next time it comes back. Um, King Trident, obviously have him, can't do go too far in his tower because I don't have Eric um, I'm very open and I'm not sure yeah King Trident is the leader for the Oceanics but he's the only leader and he's really the only leader um, for, for Little Mermaid so it's not even a really a true Oceanic leadership it's just for um, himself Eric and 
himself Eric and um, himself, himself Eric and Ariel. I'm sorry, Got a little tongue tied there for a second. Um, and then we get the Wilds. There is your leadership on Wilds. It's I'm pretty sure it's Simba. Yeah, something to pride. doesn't really do a whole lot you know as you can see they've it, it it's it's effective for for club wars making um well it's a little bit more viable in club wars i'm not sure um you know obviously he is a little synergy synergist he synergist a very little bit with rafiki um but that's what his uh leadership does is it's for um club wars so, and there is no other um, wild leadership. And uh, there's not really a wild team, so to speak. So that's why I'm thinking that the next team we're going to get is going to be wilds. If, uh, if you're not new to this game, and you've been playing since uh, perhaps launch, um, and just a little bit of information if, you, if you're new to this game, um, last summer they did some um, surveys where they were like, you know, how would you rank these five characters on your your level of excitement about how how willing you, willingly you would be able to if you were able to play them. And um, I, I believe I believe that Rapunzel was on that list. I believe Belle was on that list. Um, Maurice might have been. Um, I'm trying to think of who else might have been on the list. Maybe Maui, maybe Moana. Um, Hercules definitely was. Hercules, Meg, Phil, Pegasus, uh, Pain and Panic, and Hermes. I can only, I can pretty much remember being on that list. Um, Finn and Maximus, I think, were. Uh, Rapunzel was. Maybe most of the Beauty and the Beast characters were. Um, and I believe that, that, like I talked about, there wasn't a true Oceanic leadership. But I believe, if I'm remembering right, I believe that um, Atlantis, the, the Atlantis characters were on, from the Atlantis movie. I don't know if you ever saw that. So I think they're going to be coming this year. I also think that... Well, there was just somebody I was thinking about. But oddly enough, in terms of wilds, and there was a cartoon. And I was voted this cartoon up because back in the day I used to watch this this cartoon a lot. And that was the gummy bears. And I believe the gummy bears are gonna be wild. You know, just based on the fact that we can we're gonna have we're gonna have Baloo and Mordu that are both bears, they both happen to be wild. I think the gummy bears are going to come sooner rather than later because there's no, there's no tr tr true team wild. And if you've been looking at what they did, what they've been doing, you know, for for the Rapunzel Tower, you need you need Maximus and Flynn, but then you also need wild characters. If you don't believe me, next time next time the wild tower comes back, I believe that's the case. Also, in the event we have right now, that's live. The Mother Gosnell Tower. Go in here and look at the information for it. it. Says wilds. You need wild characters. You need wilds characters. You need wilds characters. So I'm thinking. Sorry, sorry about that. So I'm thinking they're saying, "Hey, this is something you need to be thinking about. Just not for, not just for Rapunzel, but this is something that's coming soon." And I also think, and I could, 
No. Could be wrong. Could be crazy. It's possible. But let's let's look at let's look at some stuff real quick. What if we what if we can? Tech. I have a full tech team in the Big Hero Six. Okay. Go to the Oceanics. Have have the, have have a leader. You know the Little Mermaid. It's only three teams, but Trident's there, and he helps with raids. And then you got Maui and Moana. Okay. And we've already talked about the possibility that they've already hinted at the Atlantis team coming. Okay. Last year. So we move up, move it to the Mythics. They put a leader in in Miguel. Miguel's leadership right here. And we have, an, an, in addition to Miguel, they just put in a whole mythical team. Hercules, Pegasus, Maggot, Phil, Hermes, Pain and Panic to make um, Hades a little bit more viable to help out that the uh, villain team that various people want to be able to use, including myself sometimes. Then we go up here to the next thing up. Kingdom. Just put in a solid kingdom team. Beauty and the Beast. Beast. Maurice. Mrs. Potts. Lumiere. Cogsworth. Bell. Poor Gaston. When they put all those guys in, they didn't touch Gaston. They didn't give Gaston a, re a, re a refresh. They also just put in Finn and Maximus and Rapunzel. So, and Rapunzel is the leader of the princess team. So we have a princess lead. We have princesses. I'll go do the princess real quick. Show you the princesses. These are the candidates of the princess team. Jasmine, Ariel, Merida, Belle, Mulan, Rapunzel. Moana, Pocahontas. I haven't put them together, but they're, but, and, you know, I've heard that, that Rapunzel and, uh, Belle and Mulan are quite good together. Then you got your tank and Jasmine, and you got your heavy healing, your heavy healing damage dealer in Merida, who they refreshed. You've got a heat. I think uh, I think Pocahontas is her healer, right? Obviously, I don't have her open, so I'm not too sure. She also helps Wild's characters. Yeah, she's a she's a wild. She, they refreshed her to make her wild wilds better. You know, just look at her. She's she does have the heal, like I said. Um, but yeah. And so, beyond that, you have a healer in. Why does this keep doing this when I? I don't want it to do that. Sorry. So I have a healer in, in Ariel. Now, I, and now Ariel obviously has her little little mermaid team that she's the healer for. But um, you know, so what what other team we've looked at? We looked at uh, Princess. Looked at Tack. We looked at Oceanic. We looked at um, Mythic. We've looked we've looked at um, King, Kingdom. Downtown is the only other team, you know, downtown. The Hero 6 is downtown. Gizmo Duck is downtown. Um, Darkwing Duck is downtown. Toy Story is downtown. Sensational 6 is downtown. Uh, Incredibles is downtown. Toy Story the Villains are downtown. So there's a lot of, a lot of room for, um, not downtown. I think just giving out what we've seen for for the fact that we that we, that we just saw the Pocahontas refresh. That we just looked at and we just saw the Pocahontas refresh. I believe, given the fact that that you need um, wild characters f to go with Finn and uh, Maximus for Rapunzel. And the fact that you need wild characters for Mother Gosnell. Let's look at Mother Gosnell real quick. Before, um, while I'm sitting here talking about it. 
Now, obviously, Mother Gothel is a villain. Obviously, her her powers affect um, go better for uh, villains. Obviously, she's a kingdom character. But why in the world would you need Wilds to unlock her if she's a kingdom character? Just a question. Now, we'll go back to my... I don't know. I'm sorry. Why, why this keeps doing this? I'm sorry. But we'll go back to my... Obviously, I haven't been working on the Wilds, you know. Just not been a priority for me, you know. I have Elsa and Kristoff at at seven stars, but realistically, who doesn't? I have um, Sven at he's maxed, but he's still at six. He's still gear tier six. I just got Simba to gear tier six. I have um, Merida at at gear tier six. Um. Why did I do this? Because um, I was almost getting taken out in the Rapunzel Tower, and I and I want Rapunzel. Um, because if you look at Rapunzel, her her uh, her team is good for um, Club Conquest and stuff, and so that's why I'm like, okay, you know what? I think I want Rapunzel. So I started getting Simba. But let's go back and let's look at his at his kit again, real quick. We know that he's the tankiest tank that ever tanked. You want defense. Defense is what he's all about. He's got health restoration. He's got um, speed meaning reduction. He's got defense um, with Rafiki. And he's got more teammates receive 20% extra bonus when defending in Club Tower. Cool. Right? We know Sven. Hair does whatever. Scar. I don't. Scar is scar. Scar is scars. Um, we got Rafiki, of course. Baloo. Who, interestingly enough, um, Baloo's been a joke of this game for a while, but they just gave him a kid overhaul. And they just made him a little bit better. Now, obviously, his stuff isn't great still, but he's more useful than he was. This, another synergy with Wild's teammates. Convert random um, harmful effect um, on a teammate into continuous healing. If teammate is Wild's, instead convert two harmful effects. Um, and then there's this. If teammate is a wild character, grant continuous healing, ret restore um, more healing over two turns. Um, call me crazy. Call me crazy. I'm just, and I'm just, I'm just, um, it's going based upon what I see. And what I think. What I really believe is the next team we're going to get is going to be the Gummy Bears. I really believe that. And so, that's where I'm heading. Um, obviously, I'm going to take a look at this um, Hercules thing. And I'm going to start slowly gearing my Wilds characters a little bit more. Um, I don't think I'm going to touch Hopper though, but I'm probably gonna I'm probably gonna get I'm probably gonna get um, Scar and Rafiki and Blue and probably Mordu up to um, Gear Six. Probably gonna look. Probably gonna look at uh, getting Sven, obviously up to tier seven, tier seven. Probably um, Mirda two, maybe maybe Simba. 
Actually, I might go, I might take blue up to tier 7, obviously, oddly enough. Start getting some, start going after blue a little harder. Um, but I could be wrong. The next team it could be Oceanic. It could be. It could be the Atlantis team. But, just based upon what I see, I don't think that's the case. I don't think that's the case. I think Atlantis will come probably in this, probably in the summer. I just don't think it's going to be right now. Because, because the, the, the newer characters like King Trident, Eric, Moana, Stitch, and Maui, and uh, Cobra Bubbles and Gantu. They're newer. All of those characters that I just mentioned are newer than Elsa, Sven, and Kristoff. Elsa, Sven, and Kristoff have been in this game a lot long longer than Gantu, Cobra Bubbles, um, Stitch, Moana, uh, Maui. They're all, they've all been, so they've done a lot to help out the Oceanics, but they've neglected. Since last summer, they've not added a single new Watts character to this game. They've given Pocahontas a refresh, they've given Blue a refresh, they've given, they've given, um, Miranda refreshes. Now, obviously, um, the Mirda and the Pocahontas were for to help out with the princess teams, but I think they were also stealthy to help the wild characters. Like I said, just doing what I think is going to happen. So I think the next team we're going to we're going to get is probably going to be. The gummy bears, I think the finger is going to be a little lackluster because if you've been if you've been following this game since the beginning, people wanted Baymax, people wanted Big, Big Hero Six. They got Big Hero Six. They got El Elsa was the first one they wanted. They got Elsa, then they wanted Big Hero Six. Then they weren't really clamoring for, clamoring for Mickey or the or Beauty and the Beast, but they got both of them. The other person they were clamoring for was Hercules. These were all characters in that survey, along with Rapunzel, Finn, and Maximus were also on that survey. The Gummy Bears were on that survey, Atlantis was on that survey, I believe the Great Mouse Detective was on that survey, and I don't know who else. But I think the the big, the, uh, if they were obviously to put the, the Great Mouse Detective in, I think they would be probably downtown. Probably, like I said, downtown's kind of saturated, so I think they're gonna catch up the wilds, and I think they're gonna do some more. Actually, put in a team for the oceanics, but I think they're gonna do the wilds first. Anyway, after that, who knows? Uh, probably wouldn't be a surprise if they if they doubled down on the uh, oceanics and went with Finding Nemo, put Nemo and his dad and Dory in Squirt. And all those guys in. And then uh, I could see maybe Zootopia. And then who knows where they go after that. Anyways, um, thanks for watching. If you like what I had to say, give me a like, thumbs up. Let me know what you think. If you think that the Gummy Bears are, are coming. Because they put Monterey Jacks in this game... Um, Darkwing Duck was in this game with a bit launch. Uncle Scrooge is in the game. They're going to put the rest of the DuckTales in at some point. they got to put Huey, Dewey, and Louie in. they got to put, um, what was the little girl from the original series? I can't remember. Launchpad, obviously. Makes sense. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Appreciate it. I'll, uh, see you next time. Till then, bye.